Link and... will uh, be in the Steam group. Just go to yes. the announcements and uh, it should be there. Yeah, another so, follow uh, on Mr. Uh, Sky68. Thank you so much for joining. So Welcome much. aboard. Welcome. I was going to say to Snake that uh, my internet isn't the problem. I have a great internet. My problem is uh, that my computer memory is uh, like really bad. And uh, it's the, the computer that slows down the game. My, my computer can't take on the internet. Okay, so host, are you kidding me? You dragged me into this war and now you are leaving? No, finish the war. Come on, man. He just started the war, dragged me into it and then just left the game. What the hell, man? Like, what am I supposed to do now? I can't win it on my own. Like... What? That's not, that's not nice, that's not nice at all. I'm still waiting on you, Snake, to join. And if anyone uh, else wants just... to join as the Iroquois and finish this war, you are... You are welcome to do so. Don't crash the plane. What? Is this a quote from some movie? I think EU4 just crashed. Okay. Oh, well, you have enough time. Don't worry. Spyro switched to Lithuania. He he tends to do this actually. You remember? Spyro started as the Great Britain and switched to the the USA later, or the Thirteen Colonies. And welcome in everyone in the chat. You beautiful people. We are just be hosting. So if you want to join the game, just download the the mod pack. A couple of mods. Nothing extreme. It's mostly stuff like the truth timers and other little tunes, tunings, no different like countries and stuff, no bullshit, achievement hunter snake. Like how could you even think that you could be able to play them? It's so overpowered it's not even like funny. <laughs> like, and there is supposed to be even more overpowered version of that. So again... <laughs> I uh, I'm not sure. Saber. You sound like you're going through a wind tunnel right now. Yes, it's like you are in the middle of tornado. Oops, sorry, I, I forgot to turn off the. The I fan. Don't know you call the, it. Fan. the fan. Yeah. <laughs> so I was trying to say that uh, there was a mod uh, where the center was in Finland, and it has like a. Plus 75 diplomatic reputation. I am not a fan of the truth timers, and I've for this particular session we have them disabled. <laughs> we are on the five year truth timer because the the other one is bullshit. <laughs> yes, it's pretty pretty easy stuff. And I know I'm not the only one who thinks that. So I'm not the fan. I'm not a fan of the new truth timers. You can tell a lot of people are because as soon as the patch was released, that mod was up in the uh, community. Yeah. yeah, I like it's a, a pretty easy mod to create. It's just I think it changes one uh, value in some uh, file. But yeah, I said like if there was no mod, I would create it myself because this is just I don't know. It just it just makes every single huge country so much more powerful. It's not even like funny. It's like it's so stupid. I don't know. It's like such a huge boost to France, and so I host don't know. So has another version of the game. That's that's not true. Try to ena disable and enable the the mods, please. Everyone else joined just fine. Snaky. Maybe you forgot to. Uh... And check um, um, enter achievement. That's why. Yeah, if 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 your game crashed, uh, the mods were reset most likely. They're all still here. Yeah, but uh, maybe you have an extra mod. Nope. Just the check, uncheck everything. Even if it's unchecked already, just check and uncheck it, and then check only the ones you want to play with. 
I know it didn't work for me. Even though I have, have had everything unchecked, I had to like enable and disable everything. First, there is a mod called the cheat mode. I downloaded it for the loss and for HRE straight away. Uh, okay, but you know, it doesn't even uh, attempt to look like it's balanced because this mode is called Achievement Hunters Balanced. Which is just stupid. The first national idea is plus 25% morale and uh, something on top of that, like, I don't know, plus one shock. And then they have all these other bullshit <laughs> national ideas, which are totally insane. And they start in the middle of North America as a Western nation. I'm not sure what they were smoking when they typed that balanced after the name. The host has another version of the game. That's pretty sad, Snake. I'm not sure what you want me to do. Was there another patch for EU4 or something? Or maybe for one of the mods? You know what? I will, I will try to just quit the game and let's... Let's uh, rehost again. Everyone else has the save file. And I hope as well, by the way, the fastest way to quit EU4 is just to shoot it down because it just takes ages to even quit. And I have only these five. Yeah, the wasteland, uh, the wasteland overhaul looks like it's updated. So that's why it doesn't work. So please, everyone, let's just rejoin the game. I hope this will work. It looks like it's like updating. Yeah, uh, you have to, and there's like a bug, I think, another one, where you have to just, uh, like, start the game, you will see the Wasteland Overhaul is like updating with the progress bar, it's not, it's not moving, just quit the launcher, start it again, and it should work. Oh, okay, so this is the reason, Snake, I knew we could figure it out. In case now, you were a little bit silent, how are you doing in the middle of Africa with nothing to do? I'm doing absolutely nothing. I'm sat watching YouTube videos on my phone. <laughs> <laughs> I was expecting a response like that. <laughs> okay, and now now to the more important stuff. How am I supposed to win this war? <laughs> like you're fine. Host, uh, host invited me in the war. Well, I wasn't ready for that. Then he lost a bunch of troops. Then retreated and sieged, I guess, his war goal and said, fuck it. So I was like helping his vassals all around. And then when he rehosted, he said, I'm not going to play anymore today. <laughs> I feel like that's not fair. What do you think, guys? You're going to be fine. I can take, uh, you know what? I don't know. He also created this huge coalition, so I can't actually attack him for this. He has like five allies, he is gaining no diplomatic power whatsoever, I guess. Yeah, I, sh I should be fine. I would be much better off if I was able to build up my 16 regiment army. But I didn't, uh, because I had no way to wage war. I was spending the money or making more money. Spyro already re rejoined. Saber is starting his EU4. Everything should work beautifully. I'm gonna stab somebody. Why? The host has another version of the game. That's stupid. Everyone is capable of joining. Uh, you know what? Jump out of the game again. And uh, check out if there is like, if you have the mods. If there is like the mod two times. It's just wrong. You have to wait for it to patch up. Outside of the game. You have to quit it. I restarted the game for you, Snake. I don't know what else I have to do. Come on. Fix it! Well, maybe uh, they should fix their broken game. Sansor, Sansor, welcome to the chat, and you don't need any DLC. The host is the only one who needs the DLC to play. I have everything, as you can see. I have every single one of the DLC, every, at least the big ones. So if you join, you will be able to play with all the benefits without owning it yourself. That's one. Great thing about you for multiplayer. There's a lot of rotten stuff throughout it otherwise. I don't think it shares the uh, uh, troops um, mod, um, 
DLCs. Yeah, yeah, I, I said the, yeah. the the major ones like the the oh, okay, right. Conquest of Paradise, World of Nations, and now Republica or Republica. Bye, David Aos. Oh my God, you took like eight guys with you. So Snake finally joining in. I can't see you, Saber yet. I can't see you. Okay, Kiznar. I know you are watching videos, but we are re rehosting, so please join the game. Yeah, it just keeps crashing on me for some reason. Um, As I said, try to check and uncheck all the mods. It's just bugged out. Some of them may be enabled, even though it doesn't look like it. And I couldn't attack Shawnee because the Iroquois were alive with them. Like, nah. Constant um, screw up. Maybe I. No, when, yeah. When, when a colonist adds a bonus uh, um, citizens to a colony, how much does it add? Mm, like, how many people it will add? Yeah. Will add. Yeah, yeah. I think that's like. Uh, it should be, uh, if you hover over the percentage, it should say. I'm not sure, maybe no, 100. I, I, I tried, but it doesn't say. Well, I'm, I don't no, know that. Maybe Snake, snake no. Snake. What's up? Uh, how many uh, colony uh, people does the colonist add when you hit the good chance? Um, not quite sure what you're saying it's kind of staticky on my end can you say it at all no? um what are you talking about colonist yeah and what about him well i'm going to try to rephrase when a colonist adds a people in the colony yeah a true the 19 percent how much does he have uh, I said I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, yeah, some sort. Uh, Snake didn't understand me. Okay. Um, is your chicksum? I can't tell. Like in Crusader Kings, the game tells you. Oh yes, two two hundred and nineteen A. That's my chicksum. That's right. It says up here. So it, you should be able to connect. Um, and if you have uh, all the mods from. Uh, from the mod pack, you should be able to join, just like all the other guys. Mm -hmm. And if you want to talk to me, just send me a friend invite on Steam, and we can talk in the game as well. How are you, Aztec? Huh? Adventures going, Snake. It's basically a reading room, waiting for, uh, you know, uh, relations to get to 200, to annex, and then all that fun stuff. Okay. Now, the national ID, like the the special like uh, text for for the natives, are pretty good. But it will still burn your powers, power, and you will lose all of this when you reform. But when you reform, you will gain so much technological advantage. <laughs> over everyone <laughs> except for the Europeans. You basically match the European technological level, which is just insane. But uh, you can't westernize because of it. You have to wait then for, to fall behind again. I think it's by eight technologies at like together combined and then you can westernize. You can't do it while you immediately have to like reform your government, which is kind of stupid as well. But I guess it's because otherwise the natives would be overpowered, I guess, maybe. <sighs> uh, I checked on the internet and the colonist adds uh, 30 people. 30 people? So it can like double the income. But it's like every month, isn't it? Yeah, and um, yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'm getting a 20% chance. So it's basically six people per year. And uh, I'm uh, losing five people per year due to the bad condition <laughs> of the land. Well, it will eventually happen in a couple of hundred years. Oh, no, I mean six people per year, uh, per month. So it, it could uh, happen. 
It could happen, but if it doesn't happen, it could take you a thousand years. Well, the, the lucky thing would be to get a colonial enthusiasm. Yes, of course. Like That's what you are waiting for every time, right? Well, I'm surprised that um, a colonist chants aren't uh, bad in this land. That's at least one good thing. Yeah. Okay, I have an edit, Sansor. I'll invite him to the voice chat as well. I hope he can join us. I will invite him to the game. And you'll see if he's capable of joining. We are still missing one dude, I think. We are missing Kiznar. Are you joining us or not? I think he's trying to join and he can't, right? He isn't even in the voice chat anymore. I think he left all together. Maybe he doesn't fancy playing as Africa. Are you in the chat? Yeah, you are in the chat on the on the stream. Just let me know if you don't want to play anymore. So we are not waiting um, for nothing. And Sansor, are you joining us? Uh, I was looking at the list of nations that can get a colonist uh, if they choose the ID. And uh, Uzbek can get uh, expansion IDs. And I think it would be really cool if they could cut off Russia. Yeah, like they, they already like, yeah, they, they need like one province up there. And they, then the Russia can't like colonize anything. It'd be pretty cool. Anyway, I will ask this gentleman. He's joining, he's in EU4. I hope he can join us. And then you'll start and I will have to deal with this mess. Left over by host. Kiznar is Andronius. I'm not sure. He isn't in on the on the steam at all. No. Uh, I'm attempting to join. It's not letting me. I may need to figure it out. Okay, so you can join us later. This will go on for days and weeks so uh, maybe it's the patch something may be wrong maybe you'll have to wait, have to wait for 1.7.1 so I guess this is everyone who will join and he's now even left I think the stream so let's just start the game he wasn't doing anything extraordinary anyway in Africa <laughs> <laughs> Although maybe he was. I'd like to point out the fact that I'm colonizing before Portugal. That's pretty good. Okay, I have to help these poor dudes in Otama. And I hope the Iroquois will stop this stupid siege and help me a little bit with with something. I can build a regiment actually. German. Can I move in in time to save you? No, they are just hanging around. They are playing just like holes. They don't care. They don't give a damn. Yellow. And, and the problem is, I like I have to separate the piece out. Otherwise, I, uh, the AI will just screw me over, and I will lose all my manpower and everything in this endeavor. Come on, I can do it. I can join in time. Yes. Smash them! Yes, nice. Stop. Thank you. You know what? I will just siege up uh, the stuff I want. I'll let the Rokwar do whatever they want. No, oh, this will be a stack wipe, a little bit of prestige for me. And even a power projection, I think. BAM! Like they, have, they have a lot of allies, like... I'm not sure why they are just sitting there. In that province and sieging with 8 regiments to top it off. Can't catch them, really. I would like to split the siege. Split another one. 
and sit over here. And you'll see what will happen. These guys should be close enough. Like, this is a huge, a huge drain on my manpower. But I think the, the, the allies of the Iroquois will in the end be able to, like, help him enough to win the war anyway. Which is another reason for me to not, like, what's my individual score with the war on actually right now? Hmm, zero percent, okay. It's not, at least it's not minus one. You cheeky bastard. You will still lose this battle and you will be stack wiped, which is fantastic. Okay. I only care about Shoni. I'll try to vassalize them. Yeah. Uh, the... I can't even pronounce that name. I'm very sorry that Wild Will and Sansor can't join us right now, but I, I don't think there will be another rehost. I uh, will play for another hour and then it will be the end of the stream. But the two one Imperial, how did you get the solid state lines and the, yeah, this is a uh, better. Uh, it's a mod. Uh, check out the, the mod pack. It's one that calls. It's called map. In in uh, in my Steam group, there's a mod pack right there. And if you check it out, there is one called better map mode or something like that, and it increases like the beauty of the map vastly. Like everything is nice, like solid colors. Like I like it a lot. It's like a kind of a felt finish. It's like strategic talk. Like, yeah, yeah. His is basically his vassals are dealing with it, and he's just sieging the war goal. So I may be actually screwed in this war. I have to win this. I I need the capital. Which is there, and I need uh, to vassalize them. Oh my god, this would be epic if it's if it's possible. Like if the Iroquois was around, host, it would be entirely possible. Mm, was I building in a, another army? I was. It's kind of unnecessary. Well, I guess I will keep it for now. Yeah, there it is. Speed up the sieges a little bit. Yeah, they're unsieging their stuff, but they have still minus seven. Is this the goal? Seneca. This isn't even the war goal. What is the war goal? Oh, this. Okay, so they are sieging it up for him. I feel like the AI will just peace out. Better graphics mode. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, 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 that's, that's it. Better graphics mode. Wild Will. even more exhaustion, right? but I need to siege the capital faster. Hmm. I don't want to waste more manpower. I may not get anything out of this war anyway. Uh, oh, I can't deal with them directly. So I may not be able to gain anything anyway. We will see. At least you'll try. And we are winning the war even with our host around. How many allies do you have even, man? Like the Cherokee, Ottawa and Patawa Tumi. Guaranteeing independence of Ottawa. So I guess that's how he was dragged into this war. Maybe I can invite... No, he's already in. Another federation. I can join the federation, though. The may be strong. Maybe hey, strong. Can you go to? Uh, uh, can you go to terrain mode for uh, 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 the one imperial, the first imperial? Oh, the terrain mode. Okay. There we go. I think even this one is more beautiful, isn't it? This looks really, really pretty. Can almost see like 
Yeah, yeah you can see individual trees, even though you, <laughs> these trees are bigger, as big as a city. That well, looks really nice. Really nice. So, yeah, everything is much nicer. Like, this is a must-have, I guess. And it even, like, it makes everything much clearer, where the borders are and everything. So I think this is, like, a must-have mod. Yes, the snake is the only one not at war. I'm guessing because he's just waiting for another war. I should cool down. I don't care about this. I don't care about any of this. I may pick up the colonists though. <clears throat> Nobles demand privileges. Yeah, it's just a different picture. The same bullshit event. Ten prestige isn't that bad though. Uh, Maya is. Uh, yeah. Oh, an upper. So separately pieced out. Okay, the Shawnee is still in. It's only about Huron. I think they will pop up over here as well, but I can't deal with them. This is like wasteful. I don't think I'm losing that much manpower right now, so it's not that big of a deal. But still. I lost like 3,000, 3, which is a lot of my manpower in this war, unnecessarily. I even dragged me into it, like, I wasn't really required to beat up the, his, his enemies. And it also means I can't declare war on Shawnee because I've been dragged into this war. The super screw over. Super extra screw over. Another follower! Tell us love, our friend, welcome aboard, and thank you for following, thank you so much. Yeah, uh, the, the only reason the Maya are still around, pretty sure, because the Zapotec is between him and the Maya, so he can't attack them. <laughs> ah. Actually, I'm ahead of these sieges, still, and they have some guys there. <laughs> That's yeah, how you I did siege. a little goof, but as the yeah, Indians, kind of like using the admin power to core. So, oh my god, they've lost this. The Huron is still around. These guys are just lollygagging. They are not doing anything. They even stopped. I think they pieced out with Lenape for some reason and take taken nothing. I'm pretty sure this is not how this war is supposed to be working. Another follower, Rista! Welcome aboard, man! Thank you so much for following! You are a great, great bunch of people! You are fantastic! And I'm like, another follower? TWH1 of TWH First Imperial! Welcome aboard! Welcome aboard, everyone! Okay! You are fantastic! Almost 200 followers! Really? Yeah. That's not that. That can't be that close. Oh my god, hype. No, they pissed out with. Holst! They separately pissed out. Okay. Chewy? Yes. Exactly, it was a Chewy event. I knew it. I, I told you guys it will happen. I knew it. I was still surprised and I'm still angry at you, host. Even though the AI pieced out. It was his fault. It was entirely his fault. And I can't finish my mission because of this. Because you have a truce with these assholes. At least I'm take out Huron. Yeah, yeah. Like otherwise, I would be super screwed. Okay, so we will just wait for this to, to for this to recover, and then I guess I will build another bullshit building. <sighs> it was a true event. 
you for chewing. <laughs> like...